section at least. Yeah, right, no, right. Um, while I appreciated Greg Lanting apologizing, I think that there is a serious issue here that, that people in Twin Falls and the City Council need to deal with. You can't have a public official attacking a citizen dishonestly. Um, he, he admitted that he should have done his research. Okay, well, I agree. But this is a legal issue. This is a legal issue. And I think it's something that needs to be addressed. So uh, on, on one hand, like I say, I, I can applaud him apologizing for it, but I really don't think it's gone far enough. And what would you like to see happen in the future or to come away from this? Uh, well, on this specific issue, I, I think something, I don't, uh, yeah, no, let me try again. Um, because I just want to get it right, yeah, you know what yeah. I mean? On Not live, so far. Yeah, no, no, right, 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 yeah. On this specific issue, I think they need to look into some sort of sanction. I don't know what you have in Twin Falls, whether it's a censure or something like that. Um, more broadly, I think that there are legitimate concerns that people in Twin Falls have. I don't think that they've been addressed by the City Council. I don't think that the entire issue has been addressed seriously. And look at what's happened in Twin Falls. You've had three crimes involving refugees since June. You've had the five-year-old girl who was sexually assaulted. You have a 33-year-old woman who was sexually assaulted just this past weekend. Then you had a guy come back who was trying to kill people that he met in the refugee program. I think that that's worthy of consideration, especially when the world is seeing a wave of Islamic terrorism. There's no other way to put it. There's a wave of Islamic terrorism. We're seeing it every few days now in Europe and here. And without blaming everybody, you have to look at it and go, well, there is a problem here and it's something to be considered. So I think the citizens in Twin Falls have tried to bring these issues up. And all that's happened so far is they've been accused of being racist. They've been attacked by city council. And I think it's time to look at not just the issues of the refugees, but also what brought them here in the first place. There's economics. Uh, and I don't think it's a situation that's worked well for the citizens of Twin Falls or the refugees, by the way. Anything else you'd like to add? Anything about asking about? Uh, I don't think you have anything. I think you have anything.